Howdy, y'all. Hope y'all is doing good today. I don't really have anything to play today. I, uh, 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 please like, comment, and subscribe. Um, I, 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 for some reason, I lost subscribers last night. Apparently, a bunch of other people did, too. I think they go through and do audits every once in a while. So it's like, uh, I just got new subscribers, and then they're going, Oh, well, so there's that, uh, there's this shooting in Texas, and the only thing I'm going to say is, Ronnie Van Zant was right, man, handguns was made for killing, ain't no good for nothing else, if you like to drink cold whiskey, you might even shoot yourself, so why don't we dump all the people to the bottom of the sea, before some old fool come around here and want to shoot either you or me, Ronnie Van Zant never liked handguns, uh, and I agree with that. Uh, and as a, I, I never thought that I was, I was in a position to ever say anything about guns ever because uh, half my toys growing up were purchased with money made from a guy who had to carry a gun for his job. So uh, uh, weapons around me have never been a problem. I don't have a problem with them. the people that carry them. Some of them I have a big problem with because they're just, you shouldn't have them. But for hunting and stuff, I I have absolutely no problems with guns or tools. I, I, I'm not one of the people that says, take away your guns. No, we, what we should do is take away the morons. Unfortunately, all the morons are the ones with the guns. So, that's enough about that. What I really wanted to talk about today was I wanted to, I wanted to give a shout out uh, to Norm at Norm's Rare Guitars because I didn't know. Norm just went through... Some shit, pardon my French, but uh, 14 hours of surgery I heard for cancer, and dude, I am so sorry. I mean, his is way, way more aggressive and worse than mine, and um, he's a warrior. He's hanging in, man. His, his wife and his daughter are posting stuff that, that uh, he's hanging in there. He's frustrated because he, he doesn't want to be in that hospital bed. I know. Dude, I know. Dude, so sympathetic, and... And, and me, I, I'm bringing a guitar with me to my chemo session, sessions. That's right, man. I I, I bring a guitar with me, and uh, they hook up, hook up the pump in my chest, and I play around it, man. Uh, it's because that's what we do, man. Oh, and I can also showcase a little bit of, um, I, I was noticing, I, I was looking for. Hear the difference here? I love this thing just because this, this push-pull pot here. I'm just on bridge pickup right now, but this, if you pull, turns on the neck. I love that piece. So yeah, man. Second position with, with that pulled out. You should have all three of them on. Doesn't really make any difference on that one. But that's why I love the electronics in these things, and that's why what mine are a little bit rare as well, just because every one of my guitars is turning out to be a unique one-off. So, so yeah, sorry about the, the no content, no uh, musical content really today, but I did want to get this out there because I, I want to give a shout out to, uh, to to Norm at Norm's Rare Guitars, and and you have solid air you behind your brother and. Uh, you know, it's it's energetic, but um, please, you know, hang in there, man, and uh, get better. You can do it. We can all do this. Um, and always look up, man. He's there for you. So um, have a great day, and uh, let's try and improve as human beings. And send some love to Norm, man. Please send some love to Norm. Uh, you know, all them, all them tasty guitars he's got down there in his shop, man. Uh, he's spent a lifetime getting there, and. Uh, shouldn't be taken away all in a couple of days so send him some good thoughts and prayers man and we're gonna get over this cancer thing hope you all is having a great day always look up i'll see you then <laughs>